guys, welcome to episode 5 of Simple Strength for Runners. I'm Coach Lex from the Distance Project, and today we're going to be moving away from that core training block that we've been doing for the past couple of episodes, and we're going to move into squatting. So today we're going to go over the basics of squatting. So people tend to find that they don't understand where to put their knees in a squat. A lot of people have them just face forward, we don't want them to cave in at all. What we want to see in a squat is that you're driving the knees out. And through that, you're screwing your feet into the ground, creating stability at the legs. So what you're doing is you're gonna screw your legs or your feet into the ground, you're driving your knees out, and now the femur has somewhere to go. It's not just ramming into that hip capsule. So what we're going to do from here is basically just, we're gonna put the hips between the legs. So from the side, what you're going to see is you're going to see my hip crease come below my knees. So if you'll see, that's the depth we're looking for. So what you're also going to see is that a lot of my weight is in the heels. I'm not coming forward onto the balls of my feet because we don't want those knees to come forward. We want a lot of this to be sending the hips back. So if you'll try to push your hips back and from there, go down. We find a lot of people will squat like this and that will put a lot of pressure onto the knees. So what we're trying to do is we're trying to make this a hamstring and glute dominant movement. So we load the hamstring, set it down, and explode it up. So try to keep those shins vertical. We're not trying to keep those knees in front. We're trying to push those hips back, load those hamstrings, come down to that squat, and drive up. So a challenge for you to to take from this is the Tabata timer that we used last week that I'll also put in the description today. I'd like you to do a squat Tabata. So what you're doing is for those 20 seconds, you're getting as many quality squats, none of this, none of this, quality squats in 20 seconds. And a good challenge is trying to match that squat number. So you're going to say, say in the first session you get six per round. Try to keep that number up. Try to go six, 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 six. So that's gonna be your challenge after this video. So awesome job today. Can't wait to hear how the squat spotter goes for you. Trying to keep those quality squats up. We're not looking for quantity. And we'll see you next episode to take the squat just a step further. Thanks so much for watching, you guys.